We just raised $950 worth of chicken in nine weeks. Here's how. Hola amigos, welcome back to Sonny's Place. My name is Emma. We just harvested our chickens last week and I wanted to share the final weight tally with you, plus costs to raise the Cornish Cross chickens over the course of nine weeks. First things first, Cornish Cross chickens can actually be harvested as early as eight weeks, but due to some outside obligations, we had to push it back one more week. Before we dive into the numbers, here's a quick recap of what it took to get to this point so you can get a better understanding of what it takes to raise your own chicken. It's always an amazing and true Truly humbling experience to raise an animal for the sole purpose of feeding your family. Since I started raising Cornish cross chickens a few years ago, it's made me so thankful for the ability to raise my own food. And that's why I wanted to share this series with you in case you're still on the fence about getting started. People often say, if I can do it, so can you. That's definitely true in this case. I grew up in the suburbs of Southern California, nowhere near farms with livestock. After marrying a farm boy from Missouri, we settled in the Show Me State and eventually purchased this 11 acre property. Here, my passion for growing our own food grew and eventually expanded to raising animals, specifically chicken, to feed my family. At that point, I already had five years of experience raising egg-laying chickens, so I was somewhat familiar with poultry. But the first time raising Cornish Cross, I had one question in the back of my mind the entire time. Will I be able to butcher the chickens I raised from one day old chicks? Hello? I've always been a person that gets attached to animals, so this was a legitimate concern from the beginning. As time went on, the chickens grew larger and larger, and the time to butcher was getting closer. And when the time came, I was surprised at how easy it was for me to make that psychological shift from seeing them as animals to bona fide food. It's sometimes referred to as that magic moment. Fast forward a week ago when we harvested our third batch of Cornish Cross chickens, raised right here on our homestead. And to the information you clicked on to get. It's also time to weigh, to weigh all that chicken. Here we go. To start with, let's keep in mind the time and money that it took to set up the infrastructure to raise our own chicken. This includes the DIY Joel Salatin style chicken tractor I built. Ah, it feels so good to finally have the meat birds in their chicken tractor. The Premier One poultry fence kit. And the Prima Heat lamp, also from Premier One. So if you're just looking to get started, keep these things in mind when you're looking at the numbers. As for this year's batch, I ordered 25 Cornish Cross chickens from Cackle Hatchery in Lebanon, Missouri. The cost for one day old chicks came in at just under $60. In total, we harvested 26 Cornish Cross chickens that averaged about five and a quarter pounds in weight. We had several chunky ones that weighed in at six pounds, a majority that came in at five, and a handful at just four pounds. The total weight of chicken raised came in at 136 pounds. That's a whole lot of chicken that's gonna feed us for quite a bit of time. As for feed, the total cost throughout the nine week period came to $245. So feed and cost for chickens brings us to a grand total of $305, not including labor and past costs for infrastructure. So it cost us $305 to raise 136 pounds of chicken over the course of nine weeks. And keeping that in mind, I also did some research to see what the cost per pound is for pasture-raised whole chicken in our area. Locally, the price per pound is anywhere from $6.75 up to $7.29, giving us an average of $7. So 136 pounds of our very own pasture-raised chicken at $7 per pound average for our area brings us to a grand total of $952 worth of chicken. Subtract the cost to raise them and we're on the upside $647. That's pretty incredible. Now, one of the things I want to address is that this price comparison is pretty apples to apples. What I see often is people comparing their pasture raised chicken to what you would normally find at a grocery store like a Walmart. But I don't think that's a valid comparison because the chicken sold in those places is not pasture raised 
like we did here. Looking at the numbers alone, I can say that this was a successful venture for us that also resulted in a quality product. As a mom, I'm also confident that the chicken that I raised here on our property is the absolute best chicken that I can feed my family with. If you're new here and you haven't watched the weekly series on raising Cornish cross chickens for meat, I'll include the link to the playlist right here and I'll see you over there. Thanks so much for watching. My name is Emma from Sonny's Place, encouraging you to grow your best life. Adios.